As you gather with your family this Christmas, it's normal to think back to easier times. Even just 20 years ago, the world didn't feel so chaotic, out of control. It feels like our society is melting down. The moral fabric that held our nation together is terribly frayed. You might look at your family over this Christmas and think, what can we do to help save our country for our children? How can we offer them stability in a world gone mad? Well, you can start by telling them that the world will always need good men because the world will always have bad men. As long as you're willing to stand with your family against the tide, there is hope for our beautiful America. America has been the light of the world since her founding, and we can reclaim that. Because in the last few years, we've all learned that all the stuff we used to think was so important back when the world wasn't crazy was a distraction. While we were enjoying living in the greatest country on earth, the left was busy taking over our society's institutions. From our woke education system that teaches our kids to hate America, hate their gender, hate the flag, hate their own families, to our sports teams, media outlets, box stores, medical institutions, these corporations hate us. Our government masked us, jabbed us, stuck us in our homes. The banks are trying to transfer our wealth into the pockets of the elites. They've ripped God out of our schools and out of our society. So why do we fight? That answer is pretty simple. Because a little baby came, grew to be a man, and died to give us eternal life. Because of that little baby, we stand as free men and women. Because of the centuries since he came, Christianity has advanced liberty and freedom all across the world and created our America. Christian men and women are not slaves, not to their sin, nor to any government or tyrant. Christian men and women bow the knee to the Christ child and nobody else. Standing against evil is an honor and a privilege for good men. We're proud to stand with you to defend and advance our right to keep and bear arms and to save this country. Merry Christmas.